Hey Salivas, this is Super Zomagar Barbecue, and unfortunately, my internet is dead. And that's the reason you've not heard from me for the last couple of days. So I just wanted to make you guys aware whilst I had access to an internet connection as to what's going on, and give you a PCC update. I can't really record much because I'm using an app called Shoe on the iPhone. It is buggy as hell, and unfortunately that means that literally I can't really do much in terms of recording because I have no internet at home. I literally am waiting for the cable uh, on around the outside of the house to be completely relayed, which will happen on Sunday, and I should be able to stream and record after that. Uh, so yeah, everything at the moment is going to come to you via this, and hopefully there's no bugs so you don't miss out on anything. But there's a lot of different cards and whatnot that I've got in the meantime, a couple of Survivor pools, some King of the Ring rewards. No, I still don't have a Pro Diva, so <laughs> I'm still <laughs> screwing over that. Um, but yeah, I promised you guys a PCC tips video and I cannot really provide that at the moment. So my only suggestion is to follow along the guidelines I have here around the uh, what, what my deck is and the kind of decks that you can use. Now not everyone's going to have Survivor Pros and not everyone's going to have the ability to what we call partially level those Survivor Pros. Um, but what I can do is show you roughly what uh, a partial deck, as they call it, looks like. And you can see it here. I've actually got Dean Ambrose, Kane, who are both partially leveled, uh, which I'll show you here now. You've also got Dean Ambrose over here. I've also used just a random rare Kane to bring my deck down just to be uh, be just above Survivor tier, so I can still get Survivor Pulse. And you've got Brett the Hitman Heart, and then my PCC Nikki, and my first ever legend, so Epic Diva, which is Naomi, uh, which is I've kept all this time, uh, just pay purely just to make sure that I had a decent Diva to, uh, I don't know, hold back and to level down a little bit. So I use this a lot in PCC, uh, in, in quite a few actually, I've used it to dumb down my deck. Now, obviously, this means I get easier opposition. And usually what I do is I throw out Kane first as a means of just getting a some kind of advantage. Because a lot of these guys have Roman or Taker. Which makes it really, really, really difficult for me to win games. So if I throw this out now. Now he's just showing out Alberto Del Rio. Um, but you'll see it now if I show uh, Dean Ambrose. This guy may just have a straightforward legendary deck. He may just have a surprise waiting at the end. Apologies for the, the battery notification there. And he has got a surprise rain at the end, which kind of screws me over. But this doesn't happen a lot. Rains, the, the rains or a, uh, a taker holding at the end is very, very, very rare. It usually happens right at the beginning or right after you've used the Divas match. So let's go after AK Fan. That's a filthy bird there. Hey, how you doing, filthy bird? Uh, there we go. We've got AK Fan here. And AK Fan, I'm just going to use straight away my Nikki. I'm just going to chuck in a support as well. Let's stick in... Sorry, let's stick in Dean Ambrose. There you go. That's a win. That's a win, PCC. And I'll show you what my rank is in a second. Speed. That's also going to be another win. I thought AK fan had a better, better deck than that. But hey, I get a perfect game. It's good. And that's going to be that. Okay. So let's just get the next ball pulls. Once it's finished waiting on that work. I'm nowhere near my next survivor pool. Okay, so if I go to my rank, my rank is number 155. I'm gradually making my way up. I'm not sure which one I'm going to go for, for yet because I would love to go for the uh, the survivor charisma support. But I know that if I grind out enough games, I can possibly get to my next ladder reward, which would be a diva, which would hopefully get me a diva pro. But no, my luck, it probably won't. And basically, that that's the aim. If I can get to there, then I will probably actually get into the top five, which I don't really want. I not don't need a John Cena card. Uh, I don't have a, a single of him, so I can't pro him. So I'm going to see how things go. I might just finish just outside the top five, purely because it may, means that I can, uh, I can get the games I need to be played. I'll probably come off titles, to be honest with you, on Sunday, once I've secured my position, and see where I go from there. But no, that's going to be it from me. I apologise if this is, this video is laggy or buggy at any point. Remember, I'm using an app that is like really, really, really rubbish on an iPhone 6 to record. Uh, and that's going to be it for me. Thank you so much for watching. I apologise for the delay in getting any content to you. If I can, I will upload 
my NXT highlights because I have, did record quite a few really awesome moments. And one of them especially was uh, Finn Balor's entrance. It was quite something. Uh, so, guys, hope you have an awesome day, awesome afternoon, and most importantly, Zoolive!